A Taft homeowner is thankful tonight after a tip from a neighbor helped him capture the man burglarizing his home. 23 ABC's Leslie Marin was in Taft where she spoke to both the homeowner and neighbors today. They flat out said, you know. Brian Payne has lived in a South Taft neighborhood for the last 19 years. It used to be a really great neighborhood. But since then, things have changed. Um, now, um, things have degraded quite a bit. Payne noticed the changes firsthand after his home was burglarized last week. I heard my little dog barking and I saw somebody walking over there straight from that house. Nobody living there. Then he goes through the house and he opened the house like he lived there. Javier Moran, a neighbor right across the street, alerted Payne about the break-in. Uh, my neighbor, he, he watches my property um, and he called me and he said, I think there's somebody in your house and I said, I'll be there in a minute. Moments later, Payne arrived. He was down middle of the block when I pulled up. I pulled up here and then uh, I chased him down and I caught him in the middle of the, the uh, block after that. But the burglar didn't go down without a fight and some help from friendly neighbors. And I took my foot up and the guy bolted and a neighbor come flying over my shoulder, little guy barefooted and he tackled the guy. I mean, it was like, it was, he was like a linebacker just tackling the guy. It was crazy. Deputies arrived a short time later arresting 29 year old Gary Sarnowski. And while they don't condone chasing after criminals, deputies weren't surprised this community stepped in. It does not surprise me. We, most of the crimes we investigate, we are able to solve them at the assistance of the, the public in one form or another. Although Payne's home was burglarized again two days later, knowing his neighbors were there has restored some hope. Absolutely. Um, yeah, there's still good people around.